Hey everybody, we are looking now at the snow day deck here at the Breakaway Football Weather Expansion. Part of the weather expansion is rain, uh, which we have in a different uh, video. This is the snow. So we see a snow themed playing surface, which has a place for the weather forecast, which would either be clear and cold, ice and sleet, or snowstorm. And those three things have specific modifiers that actually change the quality of play based on the condition of the field. Those go there. And then we also have on extreme cold days, uh, this icon, which would trigger more loose ball opportunities. Now there are typically more fumbles in super duper cold weather games. So that's why that's there. The first thing about cold weather is that all games are slightly shorter. The research that we did uh, statistically showed that we should be doing 14 cards instead of 15. So when you select your cold weather experience, First thing you're going to do is actually discard one of your offensive cards permanently for the entire game. You'll play each quarter as a 14 minute quarter. Next is we'll look inside the weather book. Right here on the back cover is the snow day forecast. This is a template and you'll draw one snow day card and place that card here in the template. And these arrows will tell you exactly how to interpret this to make sure that you have the right weather. The middle color here is blue, and so we follow the arrow out to the blue, and we see that that means snowstorm. So this snowstorm is going to go right here, and these modifiers will apply for the entire day. When we look at the wind, we see that here we've got no wind because it's not a minus one or a minus two, so we don't need to worry about the wind. We can just mark the wind as calm and no wind. It is possible to have uh, up to storm force winds, we're also going to look at the temperature. So if you take a look here in the upper corner, the zero, it means that it's zero degrees, which means this is a super cold day. So to make sure that we reflect that on the board, we're going to use these little blue markers and cover up each of these with the blue token. So now we know that it's an extremely cold day. And that means that any time one of these icons comes up, and there's only three of them in the deck, but one of these icons that matches the temperature thermometer here, that means that a loose ball opportunity will happen. Now, what's a loose ball opportunity? Well, everything's explained here in the rule book, so you can check that out on your own. Essentially, it means that it's a fumble, but that fumble is not necessarily a lost possession. You would pull the next card, in the game day deck, the snow day deck, and you would look to see what color this text is. If it's green, the offense recovers, and if it's red, the defense recovers. Let's see. Here's an example of red text. This is one where the defense would recover it. What's delightful about this is that both teams have the modifiers in front of them, and so each player can see very clearly how their game is impacted by the weather. Ice and Sleep, for example, has modifiers on different types of runs. It has low accuracy passing and it has a modifier here to the kicking game. So when we have our decision here, we need to make sure that we update the end zones to reflect the challenges on the kicking game. No wind means it's calm, so we're simply gonna find the minus one modifiers and place those in each end zone. And that lets us know that we are gonna have a slightly harder time kicking today. When you put the modifiers in the end zone, it's important to remember that in snow, you have a slightly lower chance of kicking a field goal anyway. And if you wanna know what the probability of the field goal is, it's on page eight in the rule book. So let's say if you're at the 20 yard line and you want to kick a field goal, you'll see that you have a base chance of 82% to hit that. But because it's a minus one, it actually feels more like a 25 yard field goal, which is a 61% chance. So just the extreme cold here of the snowstorm is actually making it harder to kick your field goal. And that's pretty much it. You'll set everything up like normal and you can play core breakaway football with any of our 16 teams in this particular environment. The environment changes each time you pull a new card. There's three different forecasts and there's three different wind speeds. So the variety is pretty high. And also this extreme cold doesn't always happen. So with that kind of modular approach, 
you can have quite a varied experience playing Snow Day Breakaway Football. Thanks.